Good YouTubers, Wix2. Um, you know what? A lot of you probably remember me by the tutorial I did when I was still part of BTV crew with uh, how to make a mop. Remember with the Staples mop? I'll put a clip up of, uh, of it sometime. It's good. It's Wix2, BTV crew. Today I'm going to be showing y'all toys how to make a mop. Later on, I mean, I took it down because my face was showing, but now I really don't care if my face is showing, so it's all good. So, uh, I'll probably put it back up, but yeah, this is gonna be part two. Um, I'm like three years older now, and I've been fucking with mops a little bit more, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, I'll put up another tutorial right now. This time we're gonna be working with a little bit more hard body ink. So, uh, I'll explain to all you motherfuckers out there who's trying to make mops at home how to, uh, set up your own shit without having to go to the store to buy a crank or a grog or any of those other, you know, mainstream graffiti material shits. So, uh, the first things you're gonna need, so the first things you're gonna need, right, is gloves. It's probably the most important thing. Then you're gonna need a tank. Uh, I chose this right here. There's like an Afrin or like some, you know, like a, a nasal spray bottle. Works real well. I really like these nasal spray bottles because, you know, you can squeeze them and, you know, you just you can unscrew them and they got this little shit up there. You can just pop the top off and, you know, stick some, stick a nib in there, right? So this is the tank or the bottle that's holding the ink, right? Now we're going to need some ink. Unfortunately, in this, this tutorial, I can't really tell you how to make ink because I already have a pre-made batch. I mean, I can give you the recipe, but I can't show you how I normally make it. So, uh, I mean, I'll, I'll put a clip of the other video up with this other ink, but this is some pretty hard body ink. Um, let me just put this camera down for a second. That's the cap after shaking it. I'm not trying to show you the whole shit. You know, pour it out of my desk or whatever, but I'm showing you that that's the viscosity of this ink recipe I'll show you in a minute. Alright. Okay, third, we're gonna need a slightly damp 2x2 two two sponge. It's about this big, you know, in comparison with my hand. Make sure it's somewhat rinsed. Alright. Mm. Okay, so uh, let's get started. First, we want to take our little nasal spray bottle, right? Make sure you got the cap for it. And uh, you just pop the top off. See this shit? You just do away with this. You don't need this anymore. We just want straight up bottle. Alright? Alright, now that we got our dry mop, uh, it's time to uh, take this right here. And just as we did in the old, in the other tutorial, I peel that shit right off. Right off. It's alright if you want to leave a little bit of this yellow sponge behind, because I mean that soaks up the ink somewhat. Right? So, this is good. Now what you want to do is you want to roll this up. You can roll it lengthwise like this. You just roll it nice and tight, right? Nice and tight. That was like this. Now, the difference between this mop and the other mop that I did was, in this mop, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna fold this shit in half, like this, to create somewhat sort of a chisel tip. That way it sucks up a little more ink. So we're gonna create this chisel tip, now we're gonna try to fit this into the mop and see if it sticks into the tank. So just kind of cram it in there, works. If it doesn't, you know, trim it a little bit. It's got to have a, it can't, it can't have a loose fit though. It can't just slide in there, you know. It's not a, it's not a fat pussy. It's got to be like a tight pussy. You just stick that shit in there and it doesn't come out. See, like this. This is not coming out. So you got this right there. Then, you cap it up. See if the cap fits on it. Squeeze it down a little bit. Now it just looks like a harmless little, uh, nasal spray bottle. Now that we make sure that the nib fits. It's time to do the dirty part. Get your gloves on. This part's gonna be grimed. 
try for they part Cause I'm simply more right It's like the ever star I'm the work the nigga Missing a few bills And do wonders for the figure No niggas who are million Like tangerines Got government issues Like in the Marines I keep my hands clean Get tunnel vision now this particular ink recipe right here is uh for hard staining it's uh what is it we got 60 pens quarter cup of rubbing alcohol uh some blue shoe polish and some fibings and a little bit of uh printer cartridge ink and some higgins indian ink now a lot of people say Indian ink is eh, but it works. And if you want, you can throw some brake fluid in there. If you want to corrode it, that's what I put in here. Or if you want to bleed through paint, like my old tutorial, you, what you do is you crack three uh, omega-3 fatty acid pills into this motherfucker and you just shake it up. And then what you do is you got to take a can of Campbell's and you pour that shit in and you let it burn for a little while. You let it just boil. When it boils, shit mixes all over the place and uh you get a better ink i'm telling you so now uh, what we want to do is after we finish making our ink we want to just fill up our shit fill it make sure you fill it three quarters of the way never fill it full because that's just gonna pop in your pocket and you're gonna be mad all right so we're just trying to Check it every now and then, you know, make sure that it's all good. A little bit more. That's good. So, make sure that's just cap tight. You don't want that popping either. So now we got our rolled up a rolled up mop top right here now you got our ink in it Oof, we might want to throw in a mixing ball I got a, little, got a couple of BBs here or at least they were here oh there they are got some BBs all right it's gonna be a little light, it's all good though. As long as it can cut through this, you know, it's pretty thin ink. Alright, now we just kick the mop top back in there. Alright, roll that cap up. Cap it nice and tight. Just shake this motherfucker up. Same night, the nuts, all in the right, sheet of test Radar paper. Steel, so excuse me for fighting. Big uh, and he still goes fighting. Like this magazine right here. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Now, see, you got an ink it up so that's nice and juicy. You already know how that is. And then, you got yourself a working mop right here. Now, on the outside, it's so not suspicious unless this happens to you because you squeeze it right before you cap it. But I mean, if this happens to you, you just grab the tissue, wipe it off before the, the ink dries. I don't, think it's, I don't think an officer from far away will uh, look at your shit and be like, yo, he has some blue stains on his nasal spray, arrest him. And if they do, they're pretty grimy cops. So, uh, harmless, but destructive as fuck. If that shit down, we share our rights. Oh, by the way, SRC headquarters right here. And, uh, here you go. Let's put this camera down. Bring a knife, wonder like a Justice League tour and see me, think money cause I'm about that. Get that rock to Brooklyn, they never doubt that. Follow my lead. Point to the fences, bay roof with a vengeance. Conan with a sword is like me with a pen, bitch. Got a pistol grip, big with a missile lift switch. Each verse twisted, harder than a hit stick. Smash mouth, blast out, doper than a crack house. Walling everything, any label you can think of. Been called everything, any label you can think of. I'm like a movie man, I'm something true. Watch me for the sushi fans. I'm hotter than wasabi. When hip hop died, I wasn't angry on the real. Go ahead, let it die. My name's on the wheel. I'm gonna give